bag and it's Prada Chanel. The booty is fake, but she got it for real. Still that way. Run up if you feel that. You ready to fight? Ready. Do it. All right, here we go. Another big night for the MMA leader from Las Vegas, Nevada's T-Mobile Arena. In a lot of seminal moments in this building, I can think of one. It was a big one for me at UFC 226. But John, also UFC 200. I got to stand across the cage from Anderson Silva in that arena. This is a place where big fights happen. And tonight, you get to stand amongst the legends at the T-Mobile Arena. Crashing here could be the beginning of the end. Ground strike gets through. Oh, he gets up here, but he is out. Dean steps in. Holy smokes. Unbelievable. Make the bad man stop. A nice stoppage win for him here tonight. And the other side just couldn't handle the incoming assault. A flurry of punches, most of them upstairs. And when those big shots land repeatedly, the referee has no choice but to step in and call the fight. Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at one minute, three seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by TKO and still the undisputed UFC lightweight champion of the world, Bad Intention. So there he is, and congratulations to the and still UFC undisputed lightweight champion. Man, was he on point tonight. He bided his time, and eventually when there was an opening, he closed the show, attributed punches there, setting up the TKO, and now he can go back.